Is that a shiny Ridge of Steel? <gasps> That's a shiny Ridge of Steel. That's a shiny Ridge of Steel. <laughs> hey guys, it's your boy Logan HDI, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Brute Bros. And today, we're gonna see what do we get if we trade a shiny Volcanium, which is a super rare, shiny, legendary, probably one of the most rarest, legendary shinies in the game, I think. And also, shout out to my boy DeSilva, who let me borrow this shiny Volcanium, and it looks so sick. It's bright yellow, which just looks amazing. It kind of looks like it's golden, like it's been painted on with the gold. Looks very, very cool. So we're gonna see what do we get if we try to trade this. I admit, I, I said in the chat that we're trading our shiny volcano, and we've got a lot of trades cooking at all. And let's see who can have the best trade and what it, what it really is worth. So our first trade is by Dark Dragon Destroy, who actually let us borrow the shiny Hooper, which was last week, or we, yeah, we, the shiny Hooper, which was super sick. And I can see he's got a shiny Genesect. Oh my god, see, he's got a lot of shiny legendaries. He's also got this um this thing here is from Sheeple, who I'm pretty sure is like an admin or a builder or like they're part of the Brick Bronze uh, development team. I think they might be a developer. I can't remember which role they're in, but they're, they're part of the team. And that's like a, it's a reskin Oddish. Is that part of like the actual, like, uh, is that from the Safari Zone? I don't think I've seen that before. I don't have that, but that's cool. That That is cool. But they're offering, oh, shiny Genesect and a Stufo. Oh, no, not a Stufo, a Beware. What's Stufo? Is that the like evolution before this? I think it is, but Beware. Oh, it's a very good Beware as well. I've already got one of these. I need to make a video on it still. That is a cool Pokemon. And then Shiny Genesect. Oh, so what's more rare? Shiny Volcanion or Shiny Genesect? I think Shiny Volcanion is because to get uh, Volcanion, you have to do like a pretty kind of sort of like a little bit of a tricky quest. You gotta like collect items and you get like a stew and then go into a cave. With Genesect, I'm pretty sure you just go up to it and, and get it. Yeah, so I think Volcanion may be better. So I'm gonna decline the trade, but thank you Dark Dragon Destroyer for the trade they've got. He's got some crazy sick Pokemon. So next trade, whoa! He's got the uh, he's got the reskin of the Honage. That's cool. He's also got this is what I saw. The shiny Luxray. Shiny Luxray looks so cool. I reckon that that looks amazing. Oh, he's offering a lot of Pokemon here. He's got a Manaphy as well. That's cool. The Grassium Z. A Grassium Z? I guess for Grass Knot. That's pretty interesting. Oh, that is cool. And the reskin of Honage. That, that's that's pretty cool as well. I've already got one of those, but it still is a very cool reskin thing. So I think Volcanion is more rare than this, but still, that Luxray, shiny Luxray, it does look very cool. I do like it a lot. It's quite a good, it's a good nature one as well. Like, pretty good. It could be quite a good, strong Pokemon. Like, its attack is very good on Luxray. Yeah, so, so that's cool, but I think I will decline. Thank you, Ultimate Rex, for the trade. I do like the Pokemon. So, let's see. Next trade, my boy, Master Boy. He's got insane Pokemon. And, yup, he's got <laughs> insane Pokemon. Oh, my goodness. He's got, I've never seen this before, a shiny Incineroar. He, uh, just Master Boy, his Pokemon. He's got so many, like, just crazy shiny Pokemon. So, okay. He, okay, well, he's switching some Pokemon around. But he is offering, I'm pretty sure it's a shiny Zapdos. Yep, a shiny Zapdos. He caught himself. That's, like, that's super sick. That's so cool. Although, shiny Zapdos is probably my least favorite shiny legendary because the shiny is just, like, not that much different from the original. Like, it's just kind of slightly different. Where, like, shiny Volcanion is completely different. That's the kind of shinies that I like where it's completely different. But still, shiny uh, Zapdos. Very, very cool. Then Amanda Buzz. Oh, I like its pink scarf sort of thing. That does look cool. It's a very cool look at Amanda Buzz. And then a shiny really cool. This is very cool as well because it's blue. And blue is my favorite color because I, I like blue. So that's cool. But, oh, I, mm, is this a better trade? To get the Zapdos, it is kind of tricky because you've got to get the pass for it then go to the island. Oh, okay, hold on. He's chucked in a shiny uh, Marowak as well. That looks really cool. That actually looks amazing. It looks like he's in like a ninja suit sort of outfit. That looks cool. That's making the trade a little bit more tempting. Hmm, it does look very, very cool. Oh, yeah. he's put the Incineroar in now. That makes it even more tempting. This is a very cool Incineroar. I've never seen a shiny Incineroar before. That just looks crazy. Like the colors on it just look crazy. So, this is a very tempting trade. Very, very tempting. A lot of super sick shinies. But I think Shiny Volcanion may be more rare than the Shiny Zapdos. I don't know. Just in terms of like actually getting to the legendary, I think it's trickier to get to the, the Volcanion than the Zapdos. But this trade here, oh, I think it's a very, very, very good trade. I think it is worth it to do the trade. But 
I'm gonna just kind of <laughs> take that Master Boy. But no, thank you, Master Boy, for the trait. He's got some crazy cool Pokemon, so it was cool to see his uh, secret stash of shiny Pokemon there. So now we've got Stokesy05, who's got all oh, a Salamence. He's got some very strong looking Pokemon. I actually don't have a Tornadus, I don't think. I never caught one myself. These are quite good Pokemon. I'm pretty sure, yeah, quite fast, quite strong. So it's, it, would be, it would be quite a cool to have one. And it can learn fly, so it's quite a good adventure Pokemon as well. But he's chucked in a Salamence. Oh, it's level 90, so it'd be very good for Elite Four. Very strong moves. That is very cool. Oh, no, he's, okay, he's chucked in his Collarbone. I, I don't have one of these either, and these Pokemon are quite good, like, very fast, good in defense. I didn't know that, but, uh, yeah, good Pokemon. I think I will decline. It's a regular Collarbone for a shiny Volcanion. I will decline it, but thank you, Stokesy, for the for the trade. That was some cool Pokemon. Next up, we've got Ramp of Blocks. I think that's how you say their name. They've got, oh, I've got some very cool Pokemon. Suicune. I don't think I have Suicune either. Maybe Maybe I do. Maybe I don't. I can't remember. But Swig, oh, that, that does look very cool. Quite cool. And then a, a Caldeo. Is that shiny? No, it's a regular Caldeo. I've never seen a shiny Suicune. That would be cool to see. But still, I don't think these two for the shiny Volcanion is worth it. I don't know. I think I will decline. But thank you, Roblox, uh, Ramblox for the, for the trade. There was some cool Pokemon in there. Next up, we've got Jackus Plays. Who's got wall? Looks like some very strong Pokemon. He's got a Jeff. Is that a manager Jeff? Or has he got the... Yeah, it's a manager Jeff has got the setup on it. That's good to see. Very cool. Ampy Bomb. Uh, so, he hasn't got any crazy Pokemon. I don't know if I would take those Pokemon. There's still some cool Pokemon in there. So, I will decline that trade. Oh, I just chucked in a Weavile in the last second. I didn't see that there. He's like, well, I take the Weavile. But then I declined it too fast. We've got Caleb. Oh, who's got a shiny Bedro? He's got, oh, is it a shiny Ash Greninja? No, just a shiny Greninja. That's still very cool, though. And a shiny Bedro. Hey, that's me. It's been a while since I've seen a shiny Beedrill. That's cool. So we'll chuck in the shiny Volcanion. He's got a whole shiny team. Is it a shiny uh, Glossaur? That looks cool as well. Shiny Glossaur is cool. And a shiny Toucan. Yeah, it's nose. It's got a different color nose. That's pretty cool. Shiny Toucan is cool. They've got a lot of really cool shinies. Is it a shiny Lapras? It is. They've got like a full shiny team. And a shiny Slowbro. Oh, that's cool. So this trade, tempting as it is. There's no shiny Legendary. So I don't think it's worth it. Still some very cool shiny Pokemon. I think Master Boy's trade is still the best. I'm not sure. Next up, we've got Big Snack Jr. Who's got, whoa, a full Legendary team. Are these shinies? I don't think so. Uh, just a regular Zapdos and a Genesect and a Rigid Ice and an Articuno. Oh, that's pretty cool. But I think with none of them shiny, I don't think it's worth it. Still, Rigid Ice does look pretty cool. But I think I'm going to decline. Thank you for the trade, though, Big Snack, for the, the trade. Let's see who's next. We've got Angry Birds Lover. Whoa! This Pokemon! I have not seen this at all in Brick Bronze. It's actually, I think, a decent Pokemon. Not really. <laughs> not really a decent Pokemon. But still, I have not really seen this at all. I didn't even know you could get that. Oh, actually, yeah, I didn't think you could get that. I don't even know how you get it, though. But those are some interesting Pokemon. He wants to trade all these to me. Whoa. This one I haven't seen before either. I think, actually, no, I think I've seen it before once, maybe. Uh, but it's got pretty good attack there. That's pretty, pretty interesting Pokemon. And a Slow King. Oh, it's not every day you see a Slow King. Because I think Slow Poke is pretty good just as is. But that's, that's cool to see the Slow Poke. So those do for the Shiny Volcanion. Uh... Nope, I'm not gonna do that. Thank you though, uh, Angry Bird Lover, for the for the trade. Next up, we got I am Haskey, who's got a Weedle. That's good to see. He caught it himself. Very nice Weedle. But he's putting the Shaman, Hooper, and Weedle. Oh my goodness, this is tempting. This is very tempting right here with the Weedle. And he's got the Shaman, mm, but they're not shinies. They're not. They're not hidden abilities. Actually, can you get a hidden ability? Wait, he's got a Steeloxite on it. <laughs> a Hooper with a Steeloxite. Interesting choice of items right there. Very. Uh, Another Steelix Eye on it. Interesting. I don't know if they know how a Steelix Eye works, but still cool as that. Oh, this one doesn't have a Steelix Eye. Oh, come on. But still, very cool Pokemon. Thank you. I am Hesky for the trade but I will decline it. Oh, we got my boy Dash Bash. What's he gonna offer? He's got a shiny Shaman. He's got a shiny Shaman. Okay, hold on. He's chucking a lot of stuff right now. Is that a shiny Registeel? Oh, that's a shiny Registeel. That's a shiny Registeel. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay, okay. My Dash Bash, my boy. I think this is the best trade so far. We've got a shiny Registeel. Looks very cool. It's not really too different from its original. If it was like bright yellow or like just, I don't know, some crazy like blue or something. That'd be super cool, but still it is cool. Shiny Shaman, that is very cool as well. Shiny Shaman is actually very quite tricky to get, so I think Shiny Shaman may be better than Shiny Volcanion, just that alone. And then he's also put
put up a shiny, not hidden ability, gum shoes. Oh, that's cool. And then a shiny crowbat. Oh, this train. Dash and bash, my boy. He's got some crazy Pokemon. This train is definitely too crazy. Dash and bash has gone too crazy, man. He's offering two shiny legendaries. I'd say, like, this trade without Registeel is probably worth it because you get Shiny Shaman, it is, I think, more tricky than to get Shiny Volcanion because with Shiny Shaman, you gotta click, like, the flowers and it's kind of, like, one that's quite tricky to catch and then, like, with Shiny Volcanion, I guess your items are a little bit tricky to get but I think the flowers are harder to get. So, I don't know, this trade, though, definitely, I think, is the best trade so far. I don't know, comment down below. What do you think is the best trade for so far from today? I think Dash Bash is Registeel, Shiny Registeel, and Shiny Shaman may be the best. But yeah, let's decline the trade. That was a crazy trade right there, though. Let's see. Is there more trades? Oh, yeah, we got my boy, Daniel Ponce, who's got <laughs> Shiny Volcanion for Shiny Volcanion. <gasps> and my boy, Ganab. Oh, Archeops. Oh, I miss my boy, Ganab. I need to use him more. I really want to get, like, a competitive one because it's actually a really good Pokemon. Good, good speed, got good attack, and it's just, it's just Ganab. It's just amazing. My boy, oh, who remembers Ganab from my adventure series? But wow, this is a trade and a half right here. You got Absol from Master Boy. That's a cool Absol. And then a shiny Mamoswine. This is actually quite a rare Pokemon because you get Mamoswine, you need a Apollo Swine with ancient power on it. So this right here is quite a rare Pokemon and very cool as well. And Shiny Volcano. So yeah, this is a better trade because he's offering those extra Pokemon and Shiny Volcanion. So it's kind of just the same sort of trade, but I will decline it. Thank you, Daniel Potts though, for the trade. Wait, is that a Shiny Ash Greninja? Yeah, it is. Oh, wow. Is that a, just a shiny? Oh, it's just a regular Marsh. It's still crazy cool Pokemon. Thank you, Daniel, for the trade, but we will <laughs> decline that. Next up, we got K-Man, who's got, oh, a Genesect. So, uh, I've already got Genesect, but still level 90. That's cool. Very strange. It's got Fly? What? I did not know Genesect could learn Fly, although it's got a Jetpack, so I guess maybe, but that's kind of, kind of weird that it can learn Fly. That's sick though, that's actually really cool. I, I do like that Genesect can learn Fly, but I will decline it. Is that a shiny uh, Gengar? Yeah, is that from the event level 90 as well? Oh, I guess this, this is an adventure team right here. Yeah, Charizard level 90. That's a, that's a pretty solid team right there. Be very good for like the Elite Four and the Champion coming out whenever that comes out, but we will decline it. Thank you, k man for the trade. Next up, we got Pro360 Ninnam, who's got, oh, Charizard. Oh, you know how to, you know how to speak my language, chuck it in some Charizards. That's cool, level 90. This is a very strong Charizard. Oh, that's cool. Whoa, he's chucked in his whole team. Okay, we'll chuck it in the Shiny Volcanion. So he's also got a Blastoise. That's very cool too. I actually don't have a Blastoise yet. So I should try, try to get that at some point. Uh, Sylveon, that is a cool Pokemon as well. And Lucario, yeah, they're the cool Pokemon. I don't think I'll do this trade. Thank you, Pro, for the trade. I'll decline it. I still think Dash Bash's trade, I think, is the best so far. But we've had some crazy, crazy trades. And all oh, my boy, uh, cool chicken. Here's a lot of crazy Pokemon as well. He's got a shiny Gigalith. Whoa! That looks sick. That actually looks really cool. I like shiny Gigalith. It does look cool. And whoa, is that a shiny Ditto? It is a shiny Ditto. Wow! That's rare. That is... That... That's rare right there. That is very rare. Oh my goodness, because I think the only way to get it is from buying it at the, uh, the the casino. It's not the casino, the game place. You know, the place in the city. I forgot the name of it. Is it casino? I can't remember, but that's the only way to get it from buying it from there. And wow, and oh, hidden ability. Sharpedo with speed boost. Whoa, that'd be so sick. That'd be so good. It's a really good one. Oh my god, this is a really good Sharpedo. That'd be so sick to try at some point. Hidden ability Sharpedo. Oh man, that is crazy cool. And a shiny Porygon. That's actually crazy, crazy rare as well because the only way to get it is from clicking it in the PC. And to get a shiny one of those, that'd be so hard to get. Like, how would you even do that? Man, the cool chicken. He's got some very cool Pokemon. These Pokemon are insane, but I'm gonna decline it. There's still some very impressive Pokemon right there. Super duper rare. Wow, that was that was very cool to see. Next up, we got Grand Spider, who's all also got a shiny Alolan Marowak. That's really cool too. He's got the ninja suit on. Oh, that looks very cool. So he's offering up a Weavile, Houndoom, Beedrill. Yeah, my boy, Beedrill. Level 80 Beedrill. Whoa. 
That would have taken a long time. Is that a shiny? Oh, shiny Scrafty! That's mean. Shiny Scrafty is very cool. I do like Shiny Scrafty a lot, as well as a Weavile, who's uh, looking very cool as well. Very, very strong Weavile right there. Yeah, he wants to do the trade, but I think I will decline it. Thank you, though, for the trade. But wow, so many crazy trades. I think Dash of Bashes was definitely worth it. I think Master Boys was worth it, I think. But comment down below. What do you guys think is the best trade from today? I don't really know. I think it might be Dash of Bashes, but that's just my thinking. But yeah, comment down below. Smash the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you in my next video. See ya.